Hi, my name is Eric and I'm your personal running coach. In this training series, I'd like to give you some valuable advice that will help you make the most out of your passion for this sport and improve your running technique. Today, I'm going to talk about your upper body. It may seem strange, but you also have to work your arms and upper body when you run. Your arms provide balance when you run and they give your stride rhythm. The abdominal and back muscles are also at work. I'll show you a few exercises. You start off gently by warming up the shoulders, performing a few movements before you get down to the serious work. Keep the arms extended but very flexible. Avoid crossing your arms to keep them relaxed and to gain flexibility. Rotate them about 15 times in one direction, then another 15 in the other direction. Once you have loosened the articular range of the shoulders, perform a few light muscle developing exercises which will work all muscle chains in your arms. Each flexion extension is performed 10 to 15 times with the intention of stretching out your arms all the way to the end of your fingers. At the end of the exercise, keep the arms fixed in place horizontally for about 15 seconds. We are now going to step things up a gear with a classic exercise, but they are often done the wrong way. Press up. Begin with a series of four to five press-ups if you've never done them before. You can even support yourself on your knees, crossing your feet behind you in the beginning. Just make sure to keep your lower back straight. Here, we're going to stick to the same principle. At the same time, we tone our upper body muscles. To do this exercise, you will need a medicine ball. They come in all sizes and weights, but a small one will already be sufficient for a good workout. The leg on the ground is fully stretched. As for the arms, they also completely stretch, this time horizontally, with the hands gripping the medicine ball. Perform three series of 20 knee raises. OK, before I let you go today, I will show you some rather special abdominal exercises, specially suitable for running. To perform this exercise, a training partner should hold your feet or you wedge them under a bench or something similar. The motion of the arms is very simple. It's the same you use when running, but at a greater frequency. Also, remember to lift your elbows high at the back and to breathe properly. Three sets lasting 20 to 30 seconds. Each will be enough to begin with. That's it for today. See you again soon for more coaching advice.